One of the most talked about stories tonight is the NFL's new policy about the national anthem. It forbids players from taking a knee or sitting during the anthem and instead allows them to stay in the locker room. If a player violates the league's policy, the team gets fined. Channel 2's Heather Prusak was at the Bills OTAs this morning. And Heather, how did the players react to all of this? Well, Kelly, the team really didn't say too much about the NFL's new national anthem policy. Some players didn't really want to get into it. Others said they haven't really had a chance to look at what the new policy is, so they didn't want to comment. Head coach Sean McDermott did, though. He kind of just stood behind the statement we saw from Bill's president, Kim Pagula, yesterday. I'll get into that in a minute, but first, let me remind you of what this is all about. This is, of course, in response to players kneeling during the anthem as they protest social injustice, and the new policy requires players and team personnel to stand during the anthem, but it does give players the option of staying in the locker room if they want. If players don't follow this, the league has the right to find teams and teams have the right to find players or team personnel as they see fit. So again, if they're on the field, they have to stand, but now they don't have to be on the field. Here's what Bill's linebacker Lorenzo Alexander had to say when asked about the new policy at OTAs earlier today. You know, really right now we're focused on football. Um, I know guys are, we're, we're focused on trying to do active things in the community, not worried about trying to uh, just protest on Sundays, but just continue that work of really making some true change and impact, whether that's talking to local officials, working with kids, and all the above of, of really trying to impact this Buffalo community as much as we can. Now, remember last year, a handful full of Bills players did kneel for a couple games. Others linked arms and some even raised a fist in the air. And head coach Sean McDermott didn't really say how he or the team plans to handle this, just that he's had brief conversations with Kim Pagula and says they'll move forward once they have more in-depth conversations. But at this point, McDermott said it's too early to decide anything. Kelly, back to you.